Hello, this is Solar Business TV from SNEC 2018. Uh, we are, you know, like uh, almost at the last day of the exhibition after Solar Future Today gala dinner, after Solar Business Club event, after big event for press and media with Tony Siba and also with uh, Ruslana. So just very shortly, I will introduce you our guests. Yes, so they are uh, a bit from the different worlds, but fi fighting for the same goal. So first, uh, for you to be between uh, different worlds. Yeah, push, 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 push. <laughs> no, 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 you know. Uh, I would say in Russian, yes, this news. Okay. <laughs> I'm shy. No, but uh, just uh, to be serious, yes. I think that, uh, I know when I spoke to Akon, mm -hmm. I asked him, Akon, can you think about solar? And he told me, no, Tomas, I cannot because it's too much serious mm -hmm. because energy is so important. But uh, actually, I like that you s think about solar because you can transfer more messages through the song to the public than just the words. Okay, so Ruslana, uh, just in very short uh, words, is a winner of a Eurovision Song Contest. Uh, she was uh, one of top 10 most influential women by Forbes. She got an uh, award from the Secretary of State exactly. for the piece, and also Grammy Awards and... World Music Awards, yeah. Exactly, exactly. So. Apparently, she's very famous, yes? Yeah, absolutely. I'm happy for this uh, um, invitation and thank you, Thomas, to be here uh, for this amazing, uh, really, solar energy days, uh, which is never end. Uh, it's endless energy uh, connecting uh, people and uh, bring us more energy and understand why we spend all our energy and time every day to provide solar energy. So now I understand with you more why I'm so crazy about I create music and I create the best words and I try to uh, not just explain people but I'm one of the people feeling when people feel the uh, solar energy sun energy we can see like new energy generation with the sun shining inside you so this is the most important thing for me and also I I will sing and dance and perform only with the solar energy only Amazing, amazing. Uh, but you see, uh, I was mentioning that you are, you know, this uh, famous uh, singer, winner, uh, etc. But I think that now you are making even more important things. So just last week, uh, Ruslana started the first concert uh, during the Eurovision to promote renewable energy and to promote solar energy. And I think that this is something so meaningful, yes? Yeah, we performed in Lisbon before uh, mm, final of Eurovision Song Contest. It was broadcast, and uh, a lot of people was there uh, on the square. Uh, a lot, thousand, thousand people uh, arrived just to perform together with me and my uh, performance. Wild energy uh, provide from the stage to everybody the great message about solar energy, uh, wind energy, and uh, uh, renewable energy as energy for peace. So we can create, we can produce energy. Everybody can produce energy. That, th this is my uh, message for everybody. Just, uh, no just, not just be user, but be producer yeah, of that. Because actually we are built from energy. So yeah? when you sing and dance, when you feel the sun energy, when you analyze the new technology, you are, you, you know, so uh, crazy about it because it's much interesting than any technologies uh, in our life, believe me. And okay, so I think that now, Sebastian was, you know, uh, listening, listening. Now I think that you energized uh, this, uh, you know, traditional <laughs> German guy from traditional TOV, Ryan and company. No, but uh, without joking, Sebastian, thank you so much. We would not uh, be here without your support. Thank you so much. So Sebastian is uh, one of the key person at TUF Rhineland, uh, which is one of the most important players in the certification quality control, but also working very closely with uh, investors. And Sebastian actually, uh, thanks to Sebastian, yesterday at our Solar Business Club, we had very important investors coming to the table. Uh, because uh, we cannot realize, you know, anything uh, when we don't have money. So, Sebastian, first of all, uh, have you been excited about uh, Ruslana being together with us during those days? Of course, I think it's a big pleasure for all of us um, to have somebody who's really promoting this from a different side. So, me as an engineer, of course, usually I'm really down to earth. We're looking into quality, we're looking into how to secure money. But having somebody here who can really transmit those engineering messages to the public, to the world, it's really important. 
Because you see, like Solar Future today, actually, we are uniting people from different areas. So Sebastian was learning something from Ruslana, and Ruslana was learning something from Sebastian, yeah? Yes. How it but it's uh, very interesting for me now understand how it works internationally. So what uh, what did you learn actually, Ruslana, from you know these meetings and also from Sebastian and other uh, industry leaders? I agree with you that interesting just have conversation to uh, to have any uh, mm, um, any events uh, just be together when we are together more. Because uh, you're going to your home, you're going to your home, I'm going to my home. And then we uh, develop uh, our project uh, by uh, um, alone. So when we are together, so it works much better, m faster, and more dynamic, more crazy. Because I support you, support me. So that, that's the important. So much important than we have any protocol. I ask everybody, join us. Join Solar Future today. It's a really great. Uh, um, platform to uh, understand and dreaming about solar energy. Doesn't matter who you are, what are you, what are you doing exactly? Uh, are you a worker or are you a singer? It doesn't matter. Are you a businessman or just a consulting? It doesn't matter. Just join us. We are fam solar family. So e we are and we are invite you. Okay. So I think it's uh, very important because uh, Ruslana is you know like a ambassador of solar. Uh, to the general public, yes, especially, and also maybe to some decision That's makers, right. and I also to, to other artists, yes? So you would like to uh, make contagious with your virus other artists, yes? Exactly, but how it works? I use renewable energy, I use solar energy in my house, I produce my music and my performance w with solar energy only. This is my lifestyle, and I produce it not just like blah, blah, I understand how it works and I ask to uh, different producers and uh, my message to musicians to celebrities to uh, participants uh, for example of Eurovision Song Contest which is huge in Europe and around the world so and I ask them just uh, produce uh, the music with uh, uh, clean solar energy that's that's really important. So I think we will help you yes with our leaders and Sebastian I have a question because uh, it was very interesting also for you. Normally you are working with, uh, let's say, uh, technical guys, investors, etc. Uh, did you learn something from Ruslana? Of course I did. So the passion, <laughs> yeah, the passion I learned. Um, as I said at the beginning, so we are engineers, usually we are down to earth. So we're looking at all the problems that can happen in the value chain. But having there somebody with a high level perspective of the whole thing, with a philosophy, philosophy that doesn't match necessarily, first of all, to ours, but I think the passion I've learned during these days with Ruslana, with also other representatives of the fashion industry, for example, that this is a spirit that we have to take all these engineers to convince even more people to go with good quality, to produce projects, to produce solar energy. Because you know what I'm thinking, actually, because uh, what you are doing, guys, yes, it's so important, yes, because uh, let's say that solar today is already big, but in the future it will be 100% almost of everything. And we cannot make this transition this revolution without the quality, yes? And you should uh, transfer your vision to the investors, etc. But I think that we should also transfer this message to the society, yes? Because at the end of the day, this is the final customer. So I believe that uh, your complicated message can be translated to human language, to the people like Ruslana, to the society, yes? What, how do you think, Sebastian? So we've been starting with all the solar, uh, solar energy approach already 35 years ago in TV Rhineland. So we've seen like uh, this evolvement over uh, almost four decades of development and we've seen also how society has changed. Whereas maybe 30, 40 years ago, people thought we are crazy. Uh, today they actually believe, wow, what you have done, developed at that time was amazing and it was visionary at that time. Today it's almost a commodity. Right, so it's uh, something that's normal. Everybody has it almost on the roof, but we see this now even further growing in s many, many countries all over the world. And I believe this is a great thing that we have developed together over a long period of time. You see, so you are mentioning that now is commodity, but I think that to make the next step of revolution, we need to have solar lifestyle. Do you agree? Absolutely, I have the solar element, uh, uh, which is uh, produce the energy. So the uh, solar panels use this technology, and I keep it uh, very close my heart. But uh, you know what? The most important: different countries has different situation, and different people uh, uh, know different information about uh, solar energy. So it's very important to uh, find uh, the way. 
uh, the way with the best message. For example, uh, some people like when a new technology bring us the uh, solar energy cheaper. Uh, one people like um, then this energy uh, produce peace, uh, so bring us peace, uh, uh, renewable That's solar like energy. Like the yes, the yeah, solar energy is the energy of peace. Solar energy keep our uh, earth. So a lot of amazing things which which is uh, um, make this energy, solar energy, very unique and universal. Gives access to education. Yes. Absolutely. When we just when we just work uh, with the different uh, target uh, uh, groups and different countries, uh, you know exactly specifically what these guys can hear. Uh, so I, I think we uh, we will do everything for for the success. Uh, Sebastian, uh, I would like to uh, Ruslana a bit now make some education for you. Okay. <laughs> so uh, Sebastian, you remember in the past uh, when uh, the market was driven mainly by the subsidies by feed-in tariff. Uh, actually, quality was not so important because investors, like even in Ukraine, they were able to recover money during three years. Yes. So afterwards, they didn't care actually what is will happen with this solar solar park because maybe they recovered money in two years. Afterwards, they make some money during next five years and then they don't care. Yes. But now the situation changed. Uh, we have almost no more subsidies in the around the world. So let's say the system should bring the money during the next 20, 30 years, yes? So actually it's not important how much you produce to today, but how much you will be producing di during mm -hmm. the, the whole, you know, yeah. mm -hmm. the whole process and uh, how much money will you spend on eventual, eventual failures, on the maintenance, etc. But Sebastian is a better specialist than me in this area. So Sebastian, how important will be now the quality, you know, in this next era of the solar revolution? Mm. So first of all, I believe actually the quality was always a very big topic already in the past when there was maybe a bit more buffer. We have to see that basically um, in the past prices of systems were much higher than it was than it is nowadays. Um, however, there was always the price pressure always and, and always with a long-term vision. So quality was from the very beginning important. Now price is coming down, we see the same trend. And the problem is if a small things, for example, you, you're losing 1% of yield, that will mess up the whole financial model. So everybody, the whole industry has to make sure that actually this doesn't happen. And that requires a very proper quality control in the very early beginning phase of the procurement, the installation and the operation. Mm -hmm. Only when the proper quality measures are being taken, we will be able to really cover 20, 25 years, 30 years of operation without any bigger problems. Not operation, but 25 years of bringing money, yeah? because this is about money. Yeah? Production. And it's of course money. Yes, yeah. Because now it's like, you know, we are speaking about return on investment during the, you know, 25 years. Yes. That's completely correct. Okay. So now, uh, because uh, Ruslana, I hope uh, you will publish, you know, this video in Ukraine. Yes. Oh, yeah. And a good uh, message, you know, that Ukraine is one of the leading uh, markets now in Europe. Yeah, the uh, best, the best exactly. Uh, so I would like to ask uh, Seb Sebastian, yes, uh, what would be his advice, because he's working yeah. very closely with the investors. What would be Sebastian's advice for the investors who are going to Ukraine? So for any emerging country, it's very, very important that the right laws are in place. Yeah? When the governments provide the right boundary conditions for investors, it's relatively easy to make a decision because they know that what they can expect. Problem is when it's the other way around, when the markets are very unclear, when the regulations are not in place, when permitting processes are not in place, it's a big risk. And then investors would be very careful in, in going to different countries. Yeah? Mm -hmm. uh, so for Ukraine, the boundary conditions have to be in properly in place and then the investors will come automatically because they will see the benefit. Right feed-in tariff, so the right incentives for investors and then the market will be boom booming very quickly. Okay. I can present Ukraine very briefly uh, for you yes. and for uh, for uh, investors. Um, uh, yes, we have uh, the best uh, green price for renewable energy to produce uh, renewable energy in Ukraine. Yes, uh, we have a lot of problem with uh, corruption and uh, it sometimes it's very difficult to uh, to start with a different project, but. Ukraine needs renewable, you know, for what? For energy independent. So it's our, you know, like national idea because it saves our life and saves our country. So this is the best way to uh, start with any renewable energy project because people support it. Everybody in Ukraine understand how it's important to be energy independent. So welcome. Okay, uh, Ruslana, because you see like uh, 
uh, we are, uh, let's say, like a X X Men team. Yes, so everybody has different power, and we are building the you know the yes, X Men yes, yes, X, yes, X yes, Men yes, team. Yes. So actually, uh, uh, <laughs> you 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 gave <laughs> us your power. Yes. <laughs> You empowered our events, you know, uh, everybody was so excited. But also, I think that you should uh, also take advantage of being here. So what would be your expectation towards the uh, solar industry leaders? Uh, you know, what you need from us, from the leaders? Um, we have to uh, make uh, solar energy as the most popular energy in the world. So that's the energy revolution. So when we uh, change this world with the sun energy, so it's, uh, you know, it's like Bible, just propose people the most light uh, energy, uh, which is um, wi with inspiration, with uh, um, clean dreams, clean uh, um, music, with the, c it's my dream, uh, create a sound groove, sound melody, some uh, dance. So it's really lifestyle. You you have also uh, amazing dress. So I have some merchandise. So what what uh, what I need right now? So if we uh, stay together, uh, produce uh, just amazing idea. The uh, very difficult provide uh, solar energy with uh, even advertising uh, campaign. Uh, because it's not Coca-Cola, it's not uh, any, you know, like any product, it's unique product. Uh, let's create unique uh, production and unique content together. So it's not like you uh, produce some um, technologies, I produce some music. No, we need to be together to produce like so unique content to Expect X-Men team. Much, yes, much interesting than any social campaign or advertising campaign or articles or blah, 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 or round table. So let's create unique content and produce it and people will, ah. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But uh, I. Uh, actually, I would like to say something because uh, Ruslana is very famous. Yes, you see on Google research, you know, hundreds of thousands uh, of results. Uh, Obama, Barack Obama has 250 million results. Uh, Ronaldo, 300 million. Arnold Schwarzenegger, I think like uh, 50 million. And I really respect all those persons. But I think that we have even bigger celebrity with us. Absolutely. Yes, who is supporting us? This is the sun. Exactly. Yes with three billion, yes? And uh, what I explained uh, to my friends from the industry that we should not chase celebrities to come with us because we are supported by the, by the biggest celebrity. Do you agree with this, Rusana? Absolutely. You are not jealous? Absolutely, it's uh, endless energy. It's most authentic energy. It's energy of the future. And the future is? Today! <laughs> <laughs> and the sun will not send us any invoice. Exactly. Solar future. Today. today, together, three, two, one, solar, solar future, future today. today. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, and uh, thumbs up for solar, yes. That was Solar PV TV in a very special interview from SNEC, no, Solar Business TV now, from SNEC 2018 from Shanghai, together with uh, two completely different people, but with the same goal, to make solar the lifestyle. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Mm-hmm.